You traveled through Hurricane on your daily commute. You know just how congested it can get. Traffic lights have been causing a hassle through there, and over the weekend, some even malfunctioned, causing heavy delays. News Channel 3's Marley Penchock joins us live. Marley, the lights were fixed, but it was unclear when that fix at certain points would be coming. Sarah, that timeline for when a fix would be coming here at the intersection of Lynn Street and Taze Valley Road, it was all unclear up until today. Whenever I saw crews come fix the issue within a matter of minutes, you can even see behind me, they said that they are currently doing some maintenance work on the lights right now. But Mayor Scott Edwards tells me that this whole thing started on Saturday, whenever the lights started flashing red and yellow, causing a mess down here. Well, he says the city tried reaching out to DOH to get a timeline on when a fix would come. However, he says they didn't get a response, sparking more questions than answers. At this point, congested traffic is a part of the daily commute in Hurricane for drivers like Betsy Ellison. I think typically it takes me about 10 minutes to take him to school and then get over here to work. And um, yeah, it's at least double right now. Traffic lights at busy intersections have been a major cause behind the mess. Mayor Scott Edwards says on Saturday, traffic lights at the intersection of Lynn Street and Taze Valley Road started flashing red and yellow. Mayor Edwards says the city tried reaching out to the DOH for a timeline on when a fix would be coming, but didn't get a response. When Tuesday rolled around, subcontractors came to fix the lights in a matter of minutes. I talked with one of them who says he first heard about the issue Monday night. I reached out to a spokesperson with DOH and asked the following questions. Why did it take days for someone to fix the issue? What is the best way for the city to report an issue if traffic lights were to malfunction again? Also, since timing is an important factor when it comes to avoiding traffic congestion, I also asked, does the timing of this traffic light correspond with the timing of the traffic light? located at the Hurricane Creek Road and Taze Valley Road intersection, which sits down the road. Just to be clear, there have been two issues, one being the flashing lights that have been fixed today. The other issue is the timing of these traffic lights, which is very important, making sure they are programmed in a certain way to try and avoid backups and congestion at all costs. Sarah, I have not heard back from DOH on if and when timing is being done. However, when I hear back, I'll let you know. All right, Marley, thank you.